Live from NBC4, this is the Channel 4 News at 5. Tonight, thanks to plastic surgery, a 19-year-old man is getting a new outlook on life. This after a party turned violent and left him severely disfigured. Details now from Channel 4's Kim Baldonado in Beverly Hills, where, Kim, that surgery took place this afternoon. That's right, Paul. Around 2 o'clock, they got started. 19-year-old Ross Anson and his mother searched the Internet for the best plastic surgeon they could find. Fortunately for them, they found a doctor with exceptional skills and a big heart. At first glance, Ross Anson looks like a typical teenager, but a closer look at the 19-year-old's neck reveals several large scars, the result of a life-threatening attack. I was just thinking, like, I was going to take my last breath and just die. Ross's ordeal began early last year when he defended a female friend's honor at a party. The guy who Ross stood up to that night threatened to kill him. Three months later, he attempted to do just that. He takes a box cutter or a razor blade or whatever he had just to cut me, and he cuts me repeatedly like seven times. I can imagine what it looked like because when I reached up and touched my face, it, it just felt like a butterfly piece of meat. It took emergency room doctors six hours to stitch him up and save his life. But it's a life that's been changed. Customers in the jewelry store where he worked were uncomfortable. And a lot of people do ask me, like, <clears throat> on an everyday basis, um, what happened? They just say, what happened, man? If you don't mind me asking, what happened? Ross started researching plastic surgery options, but quickly realized he couldn't afford it until he met Dr. Brett Mulliken, a Beverly Hills plastic surgeon. And it just touched me that he had had this absolutely horrific thing happen to him. Someone tried to cut his throat and kill him and with a box cutter, and it was just so horrific. For years, Dr. Mulliken has provided free services for veterans, domestic abuse victims, and children. Through his foundation called About Face, he's conducting Ross's surgery free of charge. I think it's very important to be charitable. You know, a plastic surgery, you make a good living, and it's nice to give back. Ross's surgery will only take a few hours, but he and Dr. Mulliken hope the results will provide a renewed self-confidence that will last a lifetime. And we just got word that surgery just wrapped up, and if all went well today, Ross will not need any further surgeries. Reporting live from Beverly Hills, I'm Kim Baldonado, Channel 4 News. All right, Kim, thank you.